Good morning. I hope you're all doing well. This is the second of four videos today. I had somebody uh, contact me and ask me about foot pounds of energy. Uh, basically what it was, what mine produced, that sort of thing. Um, and it's, it's a good question. You have a lot of people tossing that term out there. It makes sense that you know what it means and how it uh, affects you. So basically, I haven't used a prop before, so I'm going to see how this works. I may have to move this back a bit or get longer arms. So FP, foot pounds of energy. It is one pound, uh, the uh, distance it takes to take one pound to move one foot of an object. That's the foot pounds of energy. One pound of force to move an object, whatever that object might be, one foot. Now, where does that affect you? Well, let's get to the second page here. I have seen uh, over and over again, people uh, post their uh, foot pounds of energy, the uh, speed the uh, foot pounds of energy, the speed they're going, that sort of thing for uh, a variety of different rounds. Uh, that's supposed to be feet per second, but I put FPE. So let me hold this back a little bit. Zeus 72. It always looks about like this. You take a real small round, like the one over here at the end, 760 green, it moves fast, 920 feet per second. 810 slows down, 880 slows down, 1082 slows down. Heavier the projectile, the slower it goes. So you want a light projectile, right? Not necessarily. What do you want it to do? Because if you look at the lower number, the foot-pounds of energy, what you have is 1428, 1421, 1388. But you go and pick a, uh, stick a real big rock in there, a real big pellet. Typically what happens in almost anybody's numbers is foot-pounds of energy, energy on target increases with a heavier round. What that tells me personally, not being an expert in this area, is this doesn't have enough barrel on the light round. A longer barrel on the light round, it would have increased and had similar, maybe even higher foot pounds of energy. But on a given barrel, like if you have a Zeus 72, I don't know what length the barrel was for this one, the, due to loss of energy, probably this one has a lower foot pounds of energy than this one. So hog hunting at 40, 50 feet, a big round is gonna leave a lot more energy in that hog on impact than the small round. So that's kinda of where I'm going at with it. To kinda of, sorta of demonstrate that a little bit, I've got a big round, 1,275 grain. And what we're gonna to do to test energy on target, if you will, uh, is 25 old fashioned Buffalo China dishes they're pretty tough. I'm gonna to see how far I get through with uh, this round hitting them with the Zoo 72. So let's grab the Zoo 72. Keep in mind the Zoo 72 is not even at full pressure. I just did a video and did one shot. So this is the second shot. And second shot is at, oh, high green. So it's not fully charged, but it's up there. So what are we gonna do? So some bone china. Oh, am I? Okay, yeah. Let's make sure we're looking dead at it. What am I going to do to some bone china? Okay. So, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, maybe? Yeah, six. So, made it through uh, 19 of those. Those 19 are, well, all over the place. That's gonna be some cleaning. Uh, six remaining. So I haven't done it. My guess would be a much smaller projectile moving faster would not have made it through 19 of them like this large projectile did. Uh, maybe that's a test for tomorrow. Anyway, I hope that covers foot pounds of energy and I hope you all have a great day. Take care, bye-bye.